Hey everyone, it's Suzanne O'Brien and welcome to video number three of the 30 days of Doulet Giver Pearls. Today we're going to talk about what it means to hold space for someone else. So it is extremely important to understand the difference between holding space and somebody coming into an environment to quote unquote fix it or to make decisions for someone else. So when you come into hold space, it means that you come to that home, to that patient and family with the highest of intention for the best outcome for them. And you come in with no judgment. You come in with no agenda. You come in not trying to fix it or rescue. You come in to bear witness and hold space with the highest intention of service to this human being that is in need. So as doula givers, we often will share that it is so very important for us to understand that it is not what we think is best for this patient and family. It is what does the patient want? What does the person want? We never are here to or should impose our views on someone else ever. We should really be listening to what the person is saying that they want and help to support that in actually happening. So this is very important and it can be very significant when you're working with families who have somebody who's facing a critical illness or at the end of life. Make sure that we understand, and I get it, that we're all very scared, but that we don't impose our own views and what we would want on that other person. That's not fair. I think the most loving thing we can do is to support another person in what their choices and decisions are, and it can also be the hardest thing we ever do. So what does it mean to bear witness, to show up, to hold space? It means to show up with an open heart with no judgment and with no agenda to be there in the highest form of service for another person. So thank you so much. This is video number three. My name is Suzanne O'Brien and I will see you in the next video. To your health and happiness.